Ladies and evens, this is Super Summer God Barbecue. First of all, I hope you're all having a fantastic day. The second thing is that today we are going to be playing some WWE Slam. And you're probably thinking to yourself, what? Slam? What? You may remember from seeing it in the shops in the high street. Everywhere you go, you may see WWE Tops cards, which have been out for a long, long time. Now they've finally bought them digital as part of, at the moment, a collectible card game. Not sure if any kind of competitive modes are coming yet, but we definitely know that this app is out. And it kind of came out of nowhere. Pokemon Go is actually released today this morning as well in the United Kingdom. And obviously this kind of came in at the same time. So it's going to be interesting to see how this app gets along. And it finally adds a trade option to WWE games which has been missing in games like WWE Supercard and also in 2K games as well. Maybe that might be the reason why we don't have a tradable game option within those games at the moment. And maybe why there's no interaction with regards to having more cards to trade in Supercard as an example. But Supercard out of the way, let's talk about Tops Slam WWE. That's what's going to introduce to us that we can start finally uh, we can now finally start collecting and trading our cards. I'm going to get myself set up. We're going to be in and out of the video, so press next here. It's about to talk about your collection, how you start your collection. It downloads a store. I'm going to get my welcome pack. So I'm going to get my welcome pack here today. We just grab your first pack. Let's get it now. Let's see who we get. And there are varying different rarities which go from common to kind of legendary status and the idea is as you get as obviously as many black cards as possible but they are the rarest cards in the game at the moment it's purely collecting so i'm literally going to grab myself my free welcome pack which is going to get in now here we go let's see what we get it's going to open up ah nice she's getting nakamura right off the bat of the announcement that he's going to be the person who's effectively the fame benefit of getting the nxt version of WWE 2K17. You may have seen this already. If you haven't, I've actually made a video about it up here. And it talks about the benefits, the Finn Balor statue, the Nakamura details as well. It's definitely worth checking out. Let's see what else we get here. So we get us other Papa Shango as well. Nice. And these are the common cards. Uh, AJ Styles, of course. And that's pretty much it. That's my first pack. But I'm really happy about Nakamura, uh, which is awesome. And I think these are all 2016. Yeah, base series. That's good. Okay, I've just selected my name. I'm going to see if I can use Zomagot Barbecue, see if no one else has taken it. I'm going to choose my brand, my roster. I'm going to go with the new guys. It could be the most popular brand WWE at the moment, which is NXT. And then obviously, I'm going to add my stuff in, which you guys can't see. Uh, let's have a look. It's actually saying, oh, my fan name's already taken. Well, are you surprised? Let's go to Super Zomagot Barbecue and let's see if that works. Because that should be right. Okay. Are you serious? People, someone's already taken up Super Zomago Barbecue. That's incredible. Okay. So in which case, we're going to have to try something completely different. So whilst we have had some trolls decide that they wanted to take my name, all I had to do is just use a completely different name. That actually, I use for my Instagram account and also for my Facebook details. So uh, people lost out there, official Super Zomago Barbecue. So if you ever see a video made by me, it's only going to be off of official Zomago Barbecue, not Super Zomago Barbecue or Zomago Barbecue because someone else is already taken those so that's real let's just go and get all my stuff put in i'm just going to get all my personal stuff put in give me guys a second and i'll be back with you in a moment i'm officially signed up completely into the game now let's go to the rewards which i can get my uh, open my first pack i didn't actually get to do my trade in the end because it kind of screwed up but i've got my free cards which is good okay so i can keep going through here now the way i understand it is if you basically play this for a certain amount of days you will actually start off with 25,000 credits, which you can use straight away. Coins, which you use straight away in the game. The best way to get free coins and earn free coins, you can watch yourself some uh, earn free coins, is just basically you can get yourself an ad, which will pop up on uh, the game. You just download some stuff you want to. Uh, you can also grab yourself some coins if you fancy getting yourself some coins as well. You can get yourself a 1 million coin spree, which you might be doing later on. Hint, hint. Uh, you've also got some additional bits and pieces. Fan feed, where you can see people are in here who are looking at getting themselves new cards. Uh, people are asking for Jey Uso's, looking for Teal Stephanie, etc. Teal's one of the tiers I mentioned earlier on. Uh, you've got Nikki Bellas as well, which is awesome. And oh, yeah, see, more people are just looking for Teal Stephanie's, man. Okay, so let's go to home. I believe, if I'm right and said, let's go over here. Got pending trades as well. 
Uh, every co so you earn coins for every every day you play the game. As far as I'm aware, for every day you log into this, you will get twenty five thousand credits or coins immediately every single time you log in for six days. On a seventh day, you then get fifty thousand. If it's running in line with Kick, that's how it's going to work. I don't play Kick myself, but it's definitely something that I may do now I've got this game. So we've got a couple of bulletins here as well as you can go into. You can see they're not working at the moment. Card exchanges where you can find people to trade with. I think we're going to open ourselves our first pack, actually. 25,000 coins ready to go. We've got a pack store, insert store here. Let's have a look. So a base series one black master pack. Okay, so this has got 1% chance for black card, a 10% chance of an orange, a 15% chance for teal, and then the others are there as well. We could go for that. Or alternatively, we've got coming soon. Uh, black master packs as well. So I've actually got a couple of free packs here which we can open. Let's open some free packs. Um, here we go. So let's get that card right now. Let's get these packs right now. These are our free packs that we're going to get. Got ourselves an Alundra Blaze. Nice. A uh, Sin Cara and a Jey Uso. Let's keep going. Let's open all these additional free packs we've got. Uh, so let's see what this is going to get us. This one is just going to be some common cards, I think. There's Alundra Blaze again. Baron Corbin. Nice. Uh, so next pack is going to be... Something that's loading. Oh, it's Hacksaw <laughs> Hacks Jim Duggan. Ho! Earthquake and Seamus. Are you not entertained by the common Seamus? Well, not, not really, mate. Not really. Uh, let's go. Let's get this next one. Open the packs. It's going to be a Naomi. Because, well, that card's not so amazing. But, you know, it's, it's decent. Ah, it's the boss. Sasha Banks and Neville. Nice. Okay, so let's just add some more. Get these additional packs. We're going to guess uh, AJ Styles. Nice, the phenomenal one. The Undertaker. And Bailey. Because I, I just officially love Bailey after NXT TakeOver London. So we go. So uh, Daniel Bryan. There's Daniel Bryan. Lots of rumors going around. Daniel Bryan's going to be the GM of SmackDown when they do the draft next week. Summer Rae and Naomi. Again, we've got Dupe Naomi. Nice. That's the first Dupe is the amazing one. On a May A Azing one. Here we go. Chris Jericho, YTJ, you stupid idiot. Del Rio, which I saw about trading earlier on. And Sensational Sherry. Nice. Okay. They can use that pack, that picture on W Supercard. They're going to be. Ah, oh, it's, it's a suspended one. Edge. And of course, Rowdy Roddy Piper. Rest in peace, sir. And we're going to get the last of our free packs. Going to get a Sawyer Fulton. I've never seen this dude beforehand. I have. Damn. A tattoo though. Ah, that's Nikki Bella. It's Booby Bella. And uh, no, damn it. Just, I think we have got three or four Naomi's. It's crazy. Three or four Naomi's. And um, basically, the, the, the fact of the matter is, is that there's a lot of free packs there. We're going to open ourselves a 25k pack. We're going to get ourselves a uh, go for the, for the, to the featured store. Let's see what we can get. It's downloading it. It says, make any coin post to gain access to this pack for one day. Yeah, I, I've done that. Okay, fine. So it's now saying we can do it. So we could go for an orange pack instead, go for two packs. I'm going to go for the the big one. going to go for the big one, okay? Let's do this. Base Series 1, master, Black Master Pack. Let's see if we actually get anything decent in this. It's going to be, we're going to open the pack now. Or what is going to be? Ah, it's Kate. Okay. It's going to be a Bubba Ray Dudley. I think this is a common. Jim Ross, which is a green. We're going to sell, we're going to get ourselves an orange here. Another Chad Gay, which is a teal. A Big E is another green. Another, is it another teal? Yeah, another teal. And uh, a Honky Tonk Man, Mojo Rawley, Apollo Crews, Jake the Snake Roberts. So we've got a couple of teals. got one, two, three teals. got Chad Gable. And we also then got an orange as well, which is actually really, really awesome. So we did actually get ourselves something that was quite rare. A 10% chance of getting an orange in that pack. All cards to get. Seth Rollins, man, the future of WWE is the one I pull as the orange. That's I'm guessing he's got quite a bit of rarities considering he's an orange card. I mean, it's not a black one. If the black one was there, then I would probably have just gone absolutely mental. So let's go to the fan feed. Let's go to, in fact, let's go to trading. Uh, let's go and see if we can go to do some trading. Let's go look for the orange Dean Ambrose. See if I can get a, a, the free way of the shield. I'm going to take my uh, Jake the Snake. I'm going to take Jake the Snake Roberts off. And I'm just going to look at there. So there is a there is a trade partner. So there is actually someone who has that card. 
So I'm going to offer two teal cards for one orange card and see what they have. Its trade offer has been successful. I'm not expecting to get anything back because the person has gone orange. It's very, very, very unlikely. We can but hope that maybe it'll come back and that, that maybe we'll get some luck there. So that's just an overview of the app. That's getting our first orange card as well. Of all cards, Seth Rollins, baby. Oh yeah, I love that. Especially the fact that he's in that white outfit as well, which is from the summer fit last year's SummerSlam. That white outfit was from. Really, really pumped for that. Let me know what you think in the comments section below. And if you can leave a like on this video, that'd be awesome. If you can also leave a subscribe as well, that'd be even better. In the description below, you'll find some nice little things. First of all, my Twitter details. Also, my Twitch details. And you'll be able to go and follow me on there. Maybe even potentially do a bit of uh, tops trading on Twitch at some point in the future. I do a lot of W Supercard content, so you need us joining the Supercard content in the future. That's it from me. Thank you guys so much for watching this first episode of Tops WWE Slam. And one last thing before you go, and that is... Sorry!